offensive efforts um, we've had um, all year. Um, you know, both um, defending and on the glass, uh, our guys came out with a lot of energy. Um, you know, and when we defend and rebound like that, I think we got a chance against anybody. Well, the last three games, kind of, you guys kind of back against the wall record-wise. I know you've been looking at it on a game-by-game -game basis, but how you know encouraged are you by, by the response over the last three? I know the result, obviously, Wednesday night wasn't what you wanted, but the last three games, you know, shutting down Providence last week, shutting down Xavier for large stretches, and then and then today, um, how do you how do you think they've they've responded? Yeah, I mean, you know, that's what we want to hold our hat on. Um, that's that's what we take pride in. Um, we want to be a team that defends and rebounds at a high level, um, and we feel like if we we can do that um, every single time we we come out, we get, give ourselves a chance. So that's that's what we want to do. What was the game plan on Kadari that were you trying to kind of get the ball out of his hands early in the game? Um, you know, we you know we wanted to guard him as uh, as tight as possible, try to be fit as physical as possible with him. Um, obviously, he's an unbelievable player. Um, you know, he, he does so many great things. Um, you know, besides just scoring, also he just passes the ball, rebounds the ball. Um, he, he does so many things for their team. So, you know, I think our guys did a good job on. Team face or forced 15 turnovers, including six from Kadari. What was it that made you guys so effective defensively? I, th I think it was just our effort. I think it was how hard we played. I thought we were very intense. I thought we, um, you know, sp sprinted back in transition every time. I thought we were in a stance for the entire possession. I think we just played extremely hard. I don't think you said anything about your offense yet, which was also pretty good. What did you think of your offense? Yeah, I mean, we, we got guys that can make shots, um, you know, uh, we, we and, you know, we work on it all the time. So, you know, I'm not surprised when we make shots. Um, yeah, and that's that's a, that's probably the thing you can control the least in basketball. Uh, so, you know, when you make shots and you defend like that, you definitely give yourself a great chance. And your, your threes kind of seem to, at least to me, come from different spots that or out of different action, and, and you kind of dribbled into a couple spots there that seemed like not your typical threes. I mean, have you guys been working differently to get you the ball in different spots over the last couple games, and how's that development been? I mean, yeah, you know, we, we go back, we watch film, we, we try to find spots, obviously, where we can attack defenses, and credit to coach and, and the coaches for, you know, getting me to those spots, and credit to my teammates for, you know, for finding me. And then, you know, I've just been, you know, taking it one day at a time, um, playing off my shot, just taking what the game gives me. So that's definitely, definitely helped. What did you what did you see in that, in that regard with, with how you guys were able to free up Brendan in some of those spots? Dixon, I mean Eric had a uh, you know a, a nice screen off ball there on the one. Yeah, I mean most of our stuff is like read and react. Um, yeah, and you know our guys you know, try to play together and look for each other, and obviously you know be open for three is a, a pretty good option for us. Um, so I think those guys do a good job of finding them. Brendan, with those threes, you gestured at your wrist pretty much after every three. What were you what were you saying when you were? <laughs> I mean, I don't even know what's going through my head when that happens. You know, I'm supposed to be sprinting back and ready to get a stop. But, you know, it's just exciting when, to see it go in. Eric, Eric, in the first half, you kind of were, it seemed like you were the first person to really get the offense going. It, they didn't really have an answer for you, especially early. What was it that made you so effective? Um, again, I mean, I just every game I try to come in and take what defense gives me. Uh, today just happened to be me scoring to start. After, after uh, Xavier, how much, how good did it feel? Be able to get all those threes off, and did, like, was there any extra motivation to want to knock some threes down today? I mean, I think just stepping in my role, you know, doing doing whatever whatever the game, you know, whatever the game says. My teammates again did a really good job of finding me. Obviously, it's nice to see the ball going in, uh, but you got to expect, you know, teams to, to come out and you know press up on you. So, I mean, it's nice when I can get some open looks like that for sure. Kyle, I know there's only so much you can control with within every individual result, but do, does the way you've kind of played collectively in the last couple of games make it at all frustrating that you're kind of at this teetering on 500 mark? Um, would you know what's inside this team and, and, and what's capable, what they're capable of? Um, you know what? I mean, for, for us, I mean, none of that stuff really matters. I mean, we're, this is where we're, we are right now. Um, we have a bunch of games left. There's a lot of lot of lot of season left for us. You know, our goal is to be the best team we can be by the end. That hasn't changed. Um, so we, we just got to continue to get better, um, come back and go to practice, try to play as hard as we possibly can in practice, and get 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 ready for our next uh, opponent. Uh, the, the way the last game ended, is this kind of a healing type of win for you guys? Yeah. I mean, I, I mean, I. I we don't. We just don't look at it like that. Um, you know, we, we look at it like you know, just doesn't matter the results. If we had won that game off the backboard three or whatever at the end, um, we would have still said, "Hey, we got to come back and get better the next day." So um, you know, that's that's our goal. We gotta we gotta go back and practice, get better, um, try to be the best team we can be by the end of the season.
Eric, what did you like about the way you guys played today? Um, I thought we were connected defensively. I thought we were giving it up for one another. Uh, that's what we talk about every single day, just being there for the guy next to you. And I think we did a good job playing together on both sides of the ball. Eric, this is three straight games where Brennan's been in double figures. Has there been more of an offensive um, scheme and mindset to get him, get the ball in his hit stand some more? Yeah, and I don't, I don't think we have an offense like that. You know, we just take whatever the, the defense is giving us. And today he got hot. And I mean, you know, we, we can see when he gets hot and when he's getting more open than, than normal. So we just try to get him in when we can. And Kyle, Tyler had five steals today. What is it that makes him such a solid defender? I mean, he's. Uh, I love. I love Tyler Burton's grit. Um, you know, he's. He's a guy that. Um, he's been in a lot of different roles throughout his career, um, and he's. He's willing to do anything out there on the floor for us. Um, I thought he was great. His energy level. He was. It seemed like he was all over the place. Um, you know, he can. Like he can make shots with the best of them. He can score um, if that's if that's what's uh, asked of him. But um, defensively, I think he's really starting to take the next step. Thing that went wrong was his, his dunk. Yeah. Ribbon. Yeah. yeah, it's gonna happen sometimes. I thought he was up there. I thought he was gonna finish that one. You came away looking like you would, would have rather him <laughs> lay it in at that point. You slammed the easily. I think no, you dribbled the No, ball. I thought it was good. I was. Th I thought it was good. I thought it was good. Him go attack the rim hard. Um, he's he's a he's a great athlete. Um, he just missed it. One time out toward the end, TV showed you you had taken Brent Brendan out, and you kind of were like patting him on the head like a proud father. <laughs> <laughs> No, I mean, yeah, we're we we we're, we're, we're a close bunch. Um, you know, we're, we're all in this together. Um, you know, we're together every day. We're, we're together more than our, we're, we're, than our families, right? So we're, we're together literally every single day, maybe not one day, maybe one day a week we're not together. So, um, you know, we're, we're in it with each other. And um, when, when guys are doing well, we're, we're happy for them. Anything else? Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thank you.